So Daniel, welcome to Norwich City. Tell us how it feels to sign for the club. Uh, it feels great. I know there's a there's a project was presented to me, and I felt like it was a great opportunity, and it was the right opportunity to take to take the next steps in my career and obviously progress maybe into the first team at some point. And you join us from Manchester City, where you've been since 14 years old. Yeah. Um, a fantastic club with a great setup. What can you bring from there to the academy here? I think, you know, at City you you learn a lot of almost football education, you, you understand the game better and I think I'll be able to bring that here and implement it in my game with the 21s and hopefully get some wins and get into the knockouts in this season, the league this season. And you were yet to make a first team appearance for Manchester City but you've been surrounded by some great role models and some great players as well. Who did you look up to up north? Uh, for me I'd say uh, it was a good friend of mine Rico Lewis, he's shown that you know, we were playing with him a year ago and then in a year or six months he just shot up and he was into the first team. So it shows that if you're patient and you wait and you work hard, your time will come. And it's shown with him and I think that's got to be me now. I've just got to be patient, take my time and eventually the right opportunity will come and I'll be able to take it. And um, you scored plenty of goals in PL2 and you were part of the under-18s Premier League side uh, winning side in 2022. That must have been a, a great achievement and experience at such a young age. Yeah, it was a great feeling, you know, to, to go to St Mary's and have the opportunity to play there. And there were, I think, seven or 8,000 fans cheering us. It was an amazing feeling and it's hopefully a feeling we'll be able to replicate here as well. Um, what made you decide um, on making the move over to Norwich then? Um, ultimately, I think I was just at that point where I felt like I needed to take the next step in my career to progress into first team football. And when my agent told me that um, Norwich were interested and they, he presented the project to me, I thought it, it was the right decision. It was a decision I had to take. And uh, what do you make of the Lotus Training Centre here today? I think the, the facilities are amazing. It looks, looks really good. It looks like it's a place where I can develop myself really well and hopefully I'll be able to do that. And onto yourself, how would you describe your playing style? Uh, I'd say I'm an explosive forward. I like to stretch the back lines. I like to get in behind and, of course, score a lot of goals. And finally, what are your goals for the season ahead with Norwich City? Um, just get a good run of games in, you know. If we can get into the knockouts in the league, that'll be a great achievement. And then hopefully maybe get a few sessions in with the first team at some point and just see where the season takes me.